In this part, we will turn back to our previous scenario, which we utilize for understanding of data link layer. Now we will see the routing table of every router that guides a router where to send the packet. I have mentioned in the scenario that router checks its routing table to see whether the destination is directly connected to it or is connected to some other network and then accordingly transmits the packet. We will see that routing table. I'm going to click this router. This is the interface. I will write enable to move from user mode to privilege mode. Here I can use show IP root command to view the routing table of router number two. Now you can see that it says 11.0.0.0 network is connected via 12.0.0.2 12 so it means that this information is guiding router number 2 that you can reach this network of 11.0.0.0 through the port 12.0.0.2 You can see that 12.0.0.2 is assigned to gigabit Ethernet 0 by 0. And this is the port that has the address 12.0.0.2. So our router Two is connected to the network 11 over here this is the network 11.0.0.0 through this port I'm going to show you again show IP root and you can see here I'm highlighting it that the network 11 is connected via 12.0.0.2 so that's how every router evaluates a packet it sees the IP address of source and destination and then check if that destination is directly connected to it or is it connected via some other router? Similarly, we can check the configuration on router number one. You can see that the network 10 is connected via port let me highlight it network 10 is connected via port 12.0.0.1 now let's see twelve dot zero dot zero dot one is assigned to this port over here and this is the network ten dot zero dot zero 
dot zero. So from this router over here, its routing table is stating that we can reach the network 10, which is over here, through this port. So that's how router checks where to send the packet in the network. There may be 10 routers connected to this device and 15 routers connected to this one. So at that time sending the packet at the right destination is important. And it is done by using routing tables. Thank you very much for listening.